Same as it ever was. Same as it ever was. Letting your day go by. Water flowing under. I like the talking heads. There's water at the bottom of the ocean. Yes. With that giant suit I'm wearing. It's not making sense. Not making sense. Huh? Is it? Yeah. With a beautiful wife. And you may ask yourself, well, well, how did I get here? Nice. The songs never made sense, but it's great. I like I like the earlier uh, talking heads. I like that shit. You know what? Uh, David Byrne. Is it David Byrne? Was that his yeah. name? Just kind of wanders around like the village. He's like a like uber New York City artist. Oh, really? Doesn't really make a lot of music or music that we would know of, I guess. He was always a weirdo, man. Of course he was a weirdo. Good stuff, though. Uh, like so psycho killer. That's a good one. <laughs> So you have this uh, guy, Pete Davidson. He was on the after show with Sam Roberts. Mm -hmm. And he relayed a little story about Mike Bichetti, who's standing by. Um, but we got a clip from um, uh, that appearance. Yes. Just to set this up for everybody. It's, it's quick. So just... Do we have permission uh, to air it, air this? I, thought I hope so. Did we have written express permission from Sam Roberts? Yeah, I don't know. I generally don't like my stuff being played on oh, other shows. Christ. Hoo -hoo. <laughs> See, I met him. So you're 17. At the, this club called the Looney Bin in mm -hmm. Staten Island. And we did... Uh, a show, and then He's talking about Mike Pichetti, obviously, mm -hmm. for the people that weren't listening earlier. And I had to drive him home, and he doesn't know where he lives. <laughs> so, so, no, this is a true story. Like we were, he was like, "Yeah, I live on uh, Forest Avenue," and we went to Forest Avenue, and he goes, "Pete, this is so embarrassing. <laughs> I don't live here anymore." And I, was like, I was like, "Where do you live, Mike?" He goes, uh, "I live by a gas station." And I was like, "There's a lot of gas stations." A gas station. Yeah. A it's gas. It, but, it, but it's in Staten it's Island. In Staten Island. So there's only 30 gas stations that we have to drive by. But no, it was. So weird. how did you find his place? We had to call his mom. No. And his mom was like, "Michael, how long have we been living?" He's like 48. I know what I'm saying. Yeah, he's so, an adult yeah. man. Yeah, so he's like, he was like, "Michael, how long have we lived at this house?" And he goes, "Oh, I'm sorry. I'm and, sorry." And you go and like, "What the fuck?" Yeah. And then I just went home after that and went to school the next day. Yeah. So there you have it. <laughs> That's so, bizarre, man. So I, I said uh, to Sam, we got to get Mike Pichetti on the freaking show to get his side to get his side of the story. Yeah. So without further ado, we welcome Mike Pichetti to the Opie and Anthony show. What's up, Mike? Hey, guys. How you doing? How all right. Okay? We're doing all right. right, man. You know, the holidays are right around the corner. We're shopping. Oh, and... boy. Oh, God, guys. I hate shopping for holidays. I just like send my brother out to get stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I don't. I don't like going shopping. I hate. I can't stomach it to begin with, guys. It's like, and it's even worse now. Why? Why can't you stomach Christmas shopping? Uh, I, I like Christmas, but it's like, you know, people all over the place. They're pushing and shoving. It's like, it's like when it rains mm -hmm. out in Midtown, when people, the umbrella people, I call them. I just like, don't like havoc that much. I just want to be in and out of the store fast. You know. Are you a little agoraphobic? Uh. I could be, yes. I, yeah. I, yeah. Oh, yeah. I am. I am, so, Anthony. That's right. Because I forgot. You know, like I don't really like. Believe it or not, I'm I'm kind of shy when it comes to not being a comic. But I I know what you mean by you are a phobic. Because I was like, uh, you so, know, if I stand stand around people for too too, you know what I mean? I get kind of awkward. Like, uh, yeah. So you, so you don't believe in the baby Jesus? No, I totally do. He I love him. He's one of my you know he uh, <laughs> loves the baby one guy, Jesus. You know, so. You love the baby Jesus. You're all in with that, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I like the holidays a lot, but I just hate the stress of them. Yeah. Um, so, so what happened with Pete Davidson? Oh, he's a character. I love Pete. First of all, I met him. He's a great comic. I met him about, like three or four years ago. He started comedy like about 15. So what happened was I had moved recently a couple of times on Staten Island in the past, you know, couple of years. Uh-huh. And where I live now, oh, God, I'll describe this area to you guys. It's like the witness protection program where I am. <laughs> I'm, I'm at the end of my block, at a dead-end street. Hardly anybody speaks English here. I'm on the third floor living up in an attic in my mother's house here. It, it's ridiculous. I feel like I'm in another, another country or a time zone. It's, it's, 
What, what do you mean by they don't speak English? What do they speak? Uh, probably it could be Russian or, or Slavic. A lot of oh, Russians, wow. yeah. A okay. lot of former Soviet fucking republics. Wow. Oh yeah, yeah. and I don't. I just you know, it could be Albanian. I don't know. They all speak. Like, oh. It's pretty close to the same stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Those, those people are very scary, man. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I see them. Uh, I see the fathers at at the uh, the playgrounds here in New York City. Yeah. I'm oh, yeah. way more scared of them than uh, than the, black people. The Russians, <laughs> than be honest, black people. To be honest with you, huh? I'm scared more of them than the Italians. They oh. are fucking intimidating. No, they went and they're at, a, at their, and they're at the playground with their young children, which yeah. is just all festive and nice. But how they talk, even in those uh, circumstances, no, you know, they're yeah, in business. Like, they would you know, kill you, they right? Bump into people, they're obnoxious. They're like, they're any, I don't know. It's I am scared of them, is right? Because I, I'm, I'm a fat guy. I just don't want to be tied to a log on the Hudson River. But uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah, they uh, they are right. a little uh, nasty when they drive their stupid pedicabs around. A lot of Russians doing that. I can't even fit in one, but it's like... (laughs) Yeah, the guy would fucking just be like, oh, boy, this is not going anywhere. (laughs) He'd be like, oh, no, I got to go to my chiropractor. Yes. Yeah. I hate, they, they look cool to ride in, but I know I can never fit, get in and out of one. Do right they now. really look cool to ride in, though? They look horrendous. I want a heater. I want uh, fast transportation. I want a little bit of metal around me just in case something <laughs> happens. Mm-hmm. Those fucking things, you couldn't get me in one of those things if it was the only way to get around. No oh. fucking way. I'm pedal- having some guy pedal me up and down the streets. What what year is this, first of all? And where are we? Saigon? I don't, I don't need it. This is an 1812 Manchuria. Yes, Manchuria. And they're more expensive <laughs> yes. than a cab ride. They yeah, are. yeah, they're yeah. Like, way more expensive. So you're out in the freezing cold right. going, uh, what, five miles an hour to your destination? Yeah. And then you get out, and it's like 100 bucks. I could crawl faster. I, I told I'm one guy, he came by me twice once, and I... I, I he goes, right. I'm like, no. I said, I'm going to fucking Brooklyn. Right. You want to pedal your ass across the fucking uh, bridge? Mm-hmm. <laughs> and, uh, and then he got all pissed at me. Oh, no. And they're obnoxious. Fuck like- you. You fucking. He said that. Yeah, yeah. He got mad. We squared off. Almost had a fight. Yeah. Yeah. I, I love this. You're Italian. Like, man, I love that we got that, like, you know, like. I got that too. Like you know, if you say no to somebody wants, it should be no. I'm not. I don't want to ride. I'm nice, right? Yeah, yeah. They um, just keep going around the block and looking at you. In the dirt. I know. They make you feel like you're on display. Those guys and the guys that try to sell you the rose when you're with a girl. Oh yeah. Hey man, rose, rose for the lovely lady. You go shut up. And then you don't try like to a... put me up on on the spot. Yeah. you Jerk off. And, and then you look like a piece of shit because you didn't buy the rose. Yeah, yeah. I'm not buying your shitty rose. So, <laughs> so Pete, that's where you live now. You live in the attic of your mom's house. Yeah, well, Mike. But yeah, I, uh, why the attic? Who's living in the rest of the house? Oh, it's a, it's a great situation. Uh, me, and my brother, my, uh, it's my a great situation. Girl, yeah, downstairs. Uh, he with his uh, brothers. Uh, with his son, and then they have, my brother has like a dog downstairs. It's like a five pound chihuahua. So they let the dog in the house, but not you. You have to be in the attic. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, I, I kind of like the attic. Oh, I bet. Yeah. It's Does it have nice. a window at least? Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. The, okay. The window's pretty good. I, you know, Is it small? One of those small ones? Uh, it's medium size. I can look at the back of a, of a swamp over here. <laughs> do, you, do you have that roof, though, where you, it's the, you can only walk in the middle because it's <laughs> right. pitched down on each side? <laughs> I know. It's like I was always, when I lived with my family, I was always in the attic or the basement. I never, like, lived in the neutral floor. You me. never lived in the house. You're always... Thank God. <laughs> ah, shit. Not yeah, good. They, they were always, like, keep them, keep them in the attic or the basement. The yeah. Room. So the story that Pete Davidson's uh, talking about, that that's from a while ago? Oh, yeah. This is probably a couple of years ago. So what happened was, I go, Pete, but, you know, he, he drove me, he started driving me home, and I go, wait a minute. I don't live here. Oh, da- oh, Don, I don't know how to get here from there. Because we like way on Staten Island is like where's an expressway. Uh-huh. And I'm like, this area is, I don't know out here. I mean, it's only 7 by 13. I'm like, Pete, I think we got to go back this way. And then we started like driving into the hood. And I'm like, no, this isn't it either. <laughs> you, know? oh you were lost uh, going to your own house. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like, wait, wait, well, this is the hood, man. I don't live close to this. I'm like, I like these people, but I don't want to be killed over here. You know what I mean? So yeah. <laughs> the cop sees you driving around those areas, thinks you're buying drugs. Oh, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Especially me, because a friend of mine told me that one time. He said, you know, Mike, he said, you'll be safe in the hood. He goes. 
You look like either a deranged cop or a member of the mafia. Don't leave you alone. Mm, well, I don't and, know. I think they'll still fuck you up, but yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, luck yeah. I, 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 good luck to you. Keep up your good nature. <laughs> <laughs> then we get, I get out of the hood, and I'm like, oh, wait, Pete, no, it's not this. Oh, yeah, I think it might be, because I haven't been over here in oh, a while. Oh, my God. He said it was near a, you said that it was near a gas station. Oh, yeah, and no, and but there's there. a bunch of gas stations on Staten Island. So would you just look at every gas station and until you recognized one? <laughs> they have like eighty. They have like eighty gas stations, with like pizzerias inside. You know, what I mean, that's that's what they have over here. Oh, is that it's what like goes on in Staten Island? Oh God, yeah, it's it's ridiculous. But oh. then we started getting close to the house. I'm like, uh, wait a minute, Pete. I think this is the. You know, and I'm like, no, damn it, we're a few miles away from this. Pete must have been like, fuck, I gotta fucking go deal through with this. This shit, but he's a kid. Right, so he can't he wants, say anything. Yeah, he wants an in and the comedy thing. And Oh, oh yeah, he was man. thinking, you know he, you know, he said that he goes, who are your friends in this? <laughs> oh, man. As we're man. driving, you know, but he's a good kid, though. But I mean, but guys, it's been a. Uh, it's been good. I got up like three days in a row to call you guys. I know. <laughs> yeah, well, well, our studio was busted, so we apologize. I, was, I felt so bad. I'm like, this is horrible because, you know, it's. And I got up the first day, and I'm like, okay, you know. And then the next day, I got up. I, I had like six hours sleep in the past three days, but I got up and I went back to bed, and I just like it's worth every minute. Though I love you guys. Wait, you uh, stay up nice late night. every night? Uh no, I get home about two. Yeah. And I, but I kept waking myself up because I don't want to oversleep. Right. So I drank a ton of water, kept running up, going to the bathroom. <laughs> Is that what you do to stay? Yeah, yeah, to keep myself awake. I'm like, I'm like drinking hot, all kinds of water. I'm like, oh God, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm how... in bed, like twisting the turn and going, Anthony's going to punch me in the face if he, if he grabs me if I'm late. You know what I mean? That's or, funny. Oh, he's going like, to put me in a headlock here. <laughs> you know what I mean? That's what the Indians used to do. I know. I'm like, oh, so damn, they would get like, up early in the morning. Yeah, that's hilarious. That really? was their alarm clock. Yeah, really. They figured out how much water to drink uh, right before bed, and that would make you wake up Gee, didn't at the know proper that. time. But they were in shape, though. They were. You know, they were. They all had uh, abs and stuff. Oh yeah. There were no fat Indians. Oh, no, you could wear a loincloth with pride. That's right. You weren't trying to hide your. Moobs. No. <laughs> well, have, Indians I, didn't have moobs. I can't hide my moobs, guys. I gotta tie them down with a rope. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> uh, right. No, but, but we finally found my house. Yeah. Well, and thank God get, for that. You know, and I was like, Pete, I'm so sorry, you know. But now you're gonna have to put your GPS on because I don't know how to get back to your house from here. Well, uh, I'm sure at that point he wasn't worried about it anymore. He was just no, glad no. he got rid of you. <laughs> No, it, it was it was different, but he. Uh, so he had GPS, but you didn't even know your address. <laughs> no, I was like, wait a minute, no, this isn't it. I'm like, well, I'll wait. Oh, Dom. no, I, I could understand if you didn't know where how to get from where you were to where you had to be. Right, it happens. because you were new uh, in that area or something. But to have GPS and you just didn't know the the numbers and the word <laughs> that make up an address. That's kind of. I know. I called my mom up, and she was, like, ticked off. It was, like, late. Cause the show ran late. I'm like, uh, what's the new address again? She goes, it's fly, you idiot. <laughs> like, that, that's only the Jeez. beginning, because when we first moved here, I locked my, my, myself out of my room by mistake. Uh-huh. <laughs> How did that happen? Uh, there was a key, and I'm like, and all of a sudden, they come home, right? Yeah. Now, my mom's a very good person, but she's also super biting and sarcastic, when she has to be, right? So I'm coming home. I see a look on her face. I go, what happened? Did somebody die? And she goes, it should only be that simple. Oh, oh geez. I go, what do you mean? She goes, and I'm looking at my door, and she's jimmying it with a butter knife, trying to open it. She has my brother trying to pull it down. You know what I mean? It's like we called my friend up in the middle of the night. It's like a plumber that came. I waited a few hours for him. The Jimmy, my door open. She was, oh God, that, and and that that was one of the first things that happened. Why'd she have to get in there if you you weren't uh, home? No, because I, I I was just locked out. I couldn't get back in the room myself. Oh. And my sleep apnea machine was in there and everything. <laughs> oh like, well. <laughs> well, you need that. Oh yes. She, she's like, she goes. She was like freaking out. She's like, you call me in the middle of the night. Look what happened. I'm like, but I, I just. I didn't realize I had the key. I always lose keys, guys, very easily. I break keys and doors by mistake. I lose them. We get to it, one. it sounds like it's exhausting to be you. Uh, sounds I, like at any turn something's going wrong. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Just basic stuff about to go wrong. Oh, oh, I actually, you know, by mistake, 
re- like months ago at work, I wore two, diff- two. I told you guys I wore two different color shoes to work by mistake. Right. So I can dress in the dark. I'm like, now I make sure I have at least a light on when I'm getting dressed. Oh well, that's good. So you learn turn the light on when you get dressed. Right. So you don't walk out of the house with two different shoes. How, how good. You, I moved up in Didn't world. the shoes feel different on your feet? No, they were. They, they both. My feet are like an eleven wide, so they both fit. But what? And I was like, wait a minute. Because I was, I was like in a rush. But I'm how? Di- like, hold on, hold on. How different were the shoes, though? Were they like, like two brands of Nikes, but two different colors, or were yeah, they two like drastic? A, a floor shine dress shoe and a <laughs> moccasin. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, yeah, yeah, it was like a black. Yeah. And like a, a sort of brownish. Dress shoes you go with, or uh, penny yeah. loafers? What yeah. do you What do you like wear? Dress shoes. I, I need. I got to get sneakers. I love them, but my feet are too fat for sneakers now. Uh oh. They don't make fat sneakers? I uh, like an 11 wide. I went into the like, they got to make fat sneakers. How are the fat people supposed to lose weight? I know. If they don't make fat sneakers. Ah, what a conundrum. Huh? That's like a Seinfeld yeah. thing yes. happening right there. They don't want us to lose weight because think about it. There's a nation of obesity, and they didn't want the, you know what I mean? They, they like having McDonald's and be choking McDonald's. Then oh, the like, conspiracy theory going yeah. on here. Conspiracy. Keep the fat people <laughs> fat, right? It's a, a false flag. <laughs> 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 no, it is, Anthony, because it's like, what's better from get that fat pig fatter and we'll put, we'll put him in a hospital bed and like train his savings or whatever, or just like let him eat healthy and look be 107. We don't need that. Well, I get think it. you could put the shitty food out there and the fat sneakers. That's a very good point. Yes. Oh, yeah, that's right. What do you call it? Uh, work those 4,000 calories off of McDonald's. <laughs> yeah. So, but you you managed to get through work with two different shoes on, so. Yeah. I, I that That's always been my story because, like, I uh, I remember one of the first times my friend in, was going to take me to meet his cousin on a date. Oh. In high school. Guy Fieri's and, here. And I was fat to begin with. Oh. And, and my belt broke. I thought we said no to Guy Fieri. Oh, is he today? He's oh, not, he's not booked for you guys. Oh, that's why he gave me that dirty look. Oh shit! Oh, no. What? Oh, Hold on, Mike. Sorry, we have a uh, little drama. Uh, oh, he, he walked down the hall and gave me some weird gang signs. He's doing an interview in the studio over there. Oh, oh boy. Uh huh. Was that the Mad Cuban with him? Cuban's here. Oh fuck! We'll we'll talk to him. Oh, oh you guys okay? Should I talk to him? No, no, wait, see okay. if we can get the Hang Cuban on, on the show. Yeah, we love the Cuban. Do you really want me to see if we? Yeah, can fuck yeah, book the Cuban. All right. Who's uh, Guy Fury's like right hand man? I saw they had food with them. The Cuban's hilarious. Sorry, Mike. Go ahead. I no, really okay. apologize. There was a whole thing that just happened outside the studio. It was oh, weird. God. I hope you guys are okay. Everything's good. Yeah, we seem to be all right. <laughs> We're okay, I hope you Mike. Guys are okay. <laughs> I gotta look through my mafia phone book. And he means it. That's the weird part. I know. Oh yeah. See, that'd be hilarious if it was just a, a line yeah, he's by the a real comic, deal. but he he meant that. Yeah. Yeah, we're all right, Mike. We no, think. No, I'm serious. I always watch my friends and family. That's number one to me. Thank you, brother. So what were you saying? I before I uh, rudely interrupted. Oh, you. I forgot. Uh, oh, about going on a date. So my belt broke. Right. And I had act. I had like. Act me like Alfred E. Newman all over my face when I was a kid you know, in high school. And I'm like, so we're walking to this girl's house, and all of a sudden, uh, my friend said, introduced me, and I heard her go, walks in the next room, and she goes, You gotta be kidding me with this. Oh, no, you heard her say that? Yeah. Wow. Oh, what wow. a fucking bitch. Not and, good. And then we went downstairs, and she's like, uh, She's like, you know, and then she warmed up a little bit, and I'm like, She's like, you know, uh, Maybe this isn't a good idea. And I'm, I'm like thinking, you know what I love those guys now? Mm. This is such a long time ago. I love it because I, I see all the women that would never date me go out me on Facebook, and they're slowly turning into train wrecks. <laughs> <laughs> so you, you, so it gives you solace. Right, yeah, right. Like, yeah. With guys, they can look sophisticated when they get older. Woman, there's no turning back. <laughs> <laughs> Woman? <laughs> she just hit. They all hit the wall, and I you know, fucking I laugh. I'm like, look at that whore that wouldn't be. It oh, took years stop. and years and years, but you're finally getting your um My revenge your come up and right. yes, yes. I love it, guys. I, you know, I'm like women aging are like this studio, I guess. Uh huh. <laughs> right, they just fall oh, apart. They fall apart. They get crackly. Their pieces start <laughs> deteriorating. Right. And then you got some oh, guy geez. in the corner snoring instead of making sure the studio works. <laughs> oh God! We got to oh, replay God. that audio. True because it's great to have social media. See what some of these whores look like. like <laughs> these whores. Are you going you know, to uh, get a special whore for Christmas for the baby uh, Jesus? No, you know, I got to be respectful on Christmas and just wait to the new year and, you know, pop a bottle of champagne open with some skank after that. <laughs> <laughs> some skank. Hey, when you, uh, when you went downstairs to talk to this girl, uh-huh. after you heard her say, say, oh, well, you got to be kidding me with this. 
Um, why did Why did you even talk to her? I was just, you know, I was only a kid. I was upset, and I was like thinking, you know, I, sh- I was going to curse her out, but I'm like, it was my friend's fr- cousin, and I'm like, oh god. And then I just tried to. I always tried to be gentle with a woman, but sometimes, uh, you know, did you like, acknowledge it? Did you say, hey, I heard what you said? Or no, I did. I, I, I just oh, woman, I should have. God, I god I kids are such habit, faggots you know? when they get like fucking nailed do? like that. You should I just know. turn around and go, really, bitch. What's so fucking special about you? Damn it, that would have worked. Yeah, that on first I, I, I on first saying, sight, I'm a piece of shit. Fuck I was gonna, you. I, I felt like saying, you know, she was about 14 or so. I was going to say, listen, Ooh. honey, in a few years you'll be sucking dick under the house. <laughs> wow, wow, right? That or that? Oh, that's <laughs> right. That, that's a hell of a jump. <laughs> That's what rejection leads to, uh, I see. Shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Andy got me fired up here. I, 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 yeah. We like when you're fired up. I know. You know why? Because, you know, as, I'll put it this way. I like people who are cool. Mm-hmm. As long as they're nice people. I don't care what anybody is. If somebody's yeah. a jackass, they're a jackass. It don't matter. You know, you could probably kill that girl now, and this, so much time has gone by. No one will know it's you. Oh, no. Not only... <laughs> <laughs> Make oh, that no, connection. She was in a neighborhood that was like, you know, kind of like, you know, where there's a lot of Joe Pesci types. Right. Oh, uh, yeah, huh? Time, so I don't know. But they're all gone now. Anyway, they're probably writing a book about different shit. But she's probably like, I want, that would be cur- I'm curious to wonder what she looks like now because she was a cute girl then, but uh-huh. you know, nothing stays forever. I mean, those, you know, she could look like a wilted fucking rose. Who knows? Right. The, <laughs> even a rose will wilt. Even a rose will wilt and turn into fucking dog shit. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> <laughs> dog shit. Oh, my God. I'm sorry. Guys. I like getting angry sometimes, guys. It's oh, fun. God. No, it's great. I've been so picked on by jerk offs. I, I love it. Oh, you know? ho- hold on a minute. Someone wants okay. to say hi to you. Hold on okay. a minute. This is, this is perfect. Oh, no. I think I found someone for you. Maybe a connection? Uh, hello. Who's this? A connection. Hi, it's me. It's Diana, Lady Dyke. <laughs> <laughs> She's got to give every iteration of her name. Right. I uh, know. Well, Lady Dyke. No, no. No, it's not everyone. Mike Pichetti, you want to go out with Lady Dyke? How old is she? How old are you, Dyke? <laughs> every question has to be answered with a question. It's always the question. Keep track, people. You'll have fun with this. Yes. Lady yeah, how Dye. old are you? I'm 51. She's 51. Okay. Sounds good. I'm I'm a, a year older. That's not bad. Well, oh yeah, but you look a little better than she does. She looks about sixty, to be quite honest with you. Well, she's you know been no, through the mill a little so, bit. Come on, no, I don't. Um, you wanted to ask me about Nelson Mandela the other day, right? <laughs> no. <laughs> why? Why the fuck would we want why Lady Di's you... input <laughs> on Nelson Mandela? <laughs> On the people on Twitter. The people on Twitter. So, so when the people on Twitter get get her going on something, right? Automatically, it's us that. Why you know, are you concerned about Nelson Mandela when you got Mike Bichetti on the line with you? I know Nelson's gone. You know he's an old guy. Well, <laughs> right, he was. Yeah, the Mad Cuban in studio. Mad Cuban's here. <laughs> Fuck We're just yeah. on the phone with Lady Di. We just booked and, you for our show. Well, yeah, we just booked you. Sit down. He was a very good man. Who? No, he was. You can't take that away from that. Well, you can. He's dead. But she's Took still talking right about Nelson home. Mandela. Anthony, he was 95 years old. Come on. Well, what did I say? I don't know. I have no Jesus idea what you're Christ. saying. Christ. You know, I hope I get that far. He was up there in age. All right, tell tell us a little bit about, give us your reflections of uh, Nelson Mandela, Lady Di. He was the president of South Africa, Right. Uh, okay. It's not a and, quiz. Uh, Just tell me how you feel about him. Well, you know, how do you want me to feel? I mean, the man was tw- 95 years old. Why so, was he happy? Why was he so great? Uh, yes. Why was he so great? Oh, God, oh, there there's the question. the question. And uh, Anthony, he was also a Yankee fan. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I'm sure he followed all the games, and uh, uh, sure that's why he died. He was bummed about the Cano thing. <laughs> I don't know about that. I don't, I don't, I don't know, know about, about that. that. Well, just, there's no sense of humor. Why is she listening to this show? No, once she has no clue what what is funny. Yeah, but he once in New York City when he was giving a speech, right. he said he was a Yankee fan. Okay. Because well, he was in, in the Yankee Stadium and stuff. you just do that? Yes, okay. you just do that. Right. You he wasn't a that. Yankee fan. Uh, why was he great? Tell me. Why was he great? There's the question. Yes. Yeah. Yes. He, he did a lot of things for South Africa. What like things? what? Give me some I examples. Never heard, I never heard of anything bad about him. You know what? <laughs> what? What about the bombings? What about when he was... Um, arrested for uh, treasonous acts and uh, 
bombings. Yeah, what do you know things about like that? that. Oh, I don't. I don't remember anything about that. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. I don't remember. Okay. Well, that's good. That's, a, that's why did you think he was in prison? Right. You know what? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, yeah, but you don't have to be young back then to know history. Yeah, and you said you wanted to call out about Nelson Mandela, yeah. so we thought you would do a little book report for yourself. And you were saying he's so great, but right. you don't know why he's great. Right. right. Wait, no, I, no, really, I don't know. I think I might have just broke my hand. I was pounding. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it fucking hurts a lot. President of South Africa. Why was right. he a great president right. of South Africa? I don't, you know what, to tell you the truth, that's it. I really don't know. And you then how could you say... Wait, 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 wait. You were the one who said you wanted to talk about Nelson Mandela. So how could you say he's great if you don't even know what he did? I don't know what he did, really, to tell you the truth. All right. How about one <laughs> inspirational quote from <laughs> Nelson Mandela? When he I died, everyone put, you know, tweeted their favorite Nelson right. Mandela uh, quote. I didn't, I didn't see the... Uh, Mine was, uh, no one is born hating. I kind of like oh. that one. I like which one, one? Which one you got? I like that one too because it's very true. It's very true. Right. Well, I don't know about anything else. <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> evident. Mike, this girl's no. perfect for you, brother. I, have, I, I, I got Nor yeah, I got him confused on. with Noriega. They're all pink on the inside, Mike. <laughs> Just remember that. Oh God. Hold on. Hold on. What? Uh, another thing too. You wanted to find out about my Christmas plans. What? <laughs> the Twitter people are driving they her roll. fucking crazy, and I love it. And please, Twitter people, keep it up. Yeah, you know we, what, we, Lady yeah, Di? Sure. Yeah, what are you doing for Christmas? Uh, we're just having a little get-together over here. Uh, my roommate is going to cook, okay? Uh -huh. And uh, everything is all set over here. How would this be interesting for anyone? Why would anyone want to know this? You just, you just described probably uh, ten... Yeah. Wait, how many Catholics? There are over a billion Catholics. Oh, you yeah, probably just explained Christmas for a billion people. <laughs> yes. Well, yeah. A little get together little here. Get together. And then, and then the extra tidbit we got was that her roommate will be cooking. Well, that's good. Thank that's God. good. What What is he yeah. going to be cooking, Lady Di? He, he's, he's talking about cooking a ham. Talking oh, about? Wow. How about that? Hey, 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 he's going to cut off the bottom of your bicep. <laughs> That's called the tricep, I guess. Mike Bichetti. Oh, uh, yeah. You got any questions yeah. for Lady Di? Maybe maybe there's a connection here. You never know. What Lady Di, do you, do you like him? Who? Yeah. Oh, no, my no. dad, yeah. <clears throat> Why? No, I'm just curious, because you're going gonna to put a pineapple and cloves on it? A, a what? <laughs> Say that one more time. Some people put pineapples on ham. Yeah. Uh, I guess he's going to do that, yeah. Oh my I, I, god. I guess. You know, because he's the one that's going to go get it, so I guess he's going to do that, yeah. Oh, I thought you'd go shopping with him, really, that's why. Um, no, no. So, no, no, I usually don't really go shopping with him. She's too busy getting drunk in the morning, Mike. She doesn't really. No, 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 no. It ain't that. It's not this is that the nightmare they don't fucking show you on Match.com, by the way. <laughs> right. These are the no, nightmares. No, no, no. I got, a, I got, I got enough. I had enough no. nightmares. Bichetta, you can beat the shit out of her. Yeah. We go to the grocery store. Sometimes I'll steer him See, the wrong way. hear me say that, which is perfect. expensive. All right. And uh, he doesn't like that. What right. do you, what, what, in the grocery I'm store, what do you do? Pull, pull the cart? <laughs> so you <can> get it. Pull all the food to you put all groceries in here to use, really? Fun for him. But I haven't been shopping with him in over a year. Oh, fascinating. No, he likes going by himself. So I thought, I thought he'd load the car up. With Gives stuff. a shit. Right. So uh, your holiday plans. I go by are... myself when I go shopping, too. You what? I go by myself when I go shopping. Oh. Wow. You're a big girl. <laughs> Very big girl. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right, I well, myself shopping. I hate it, really. Yeah. Lady Di, how many uh, Natty Lights are you into right now? Uh, what do you mean? How many Natty what Lights you have you had? It's not a what do you mean question. Yeah. You want to know the truth? Yeah. yeah. This is my second one. <laughs> Your second Natty Ice. <laughs> hold on. Mike Fouché, I got to put you on hold because uh, <laughs> we, we have to hold on a minute. It's quarter to 9 a.m. Uh, yes. Uh, Colin Quinn, what's up? Oh, Colin. Oh, Colin. Hey, Colin. <laughs> you called in the middle of a fucking train wreck. We got Mike Machete, but he's on hold right now, and you're on the line with Lady oh. Di. You're Lady on... Di, second, uh, second Natty Ice Deep. Right. 
I, I heard that, yeah. Yeah, we're yeah. very oh, thrilled. It's Friday. I know it's, I know <laughs> it's not a good thing, but, um, oh. yeah. Right. Well, Colin, I hope you were listening when Lady Di uh, gave everyone her Christmas plans. <laughs> what is it, Lady Di? Wait, let me guess. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> Would you like to come over? <laughs> oh, wow. Colin, you I'd got, love to. You got, you got a <laughs> Lady Di must love all these guys fawning over her on the phone. <laughs> uh, just one more thing. Oh. Marion and I Marion and I wanted to say Merry Christmas to the both of you. Uh, she told me that you might be off next week. Who is this Marion uh, broad you talk off. about all the time? Yeah, nobody's heard uh, from her in months. I know. No. Uh, ever since months. the N word incident. <laughs> she follows me now on Facebook though. Who? Marion? Marion. Oh good. I follow Yes. All right, we know. I know. It's <laughs> all know. about you, isn't it? Marion is kind of it's it's kind of like she's become like Shirley, and you're like Penny Marshall who goes on to direct. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Cindy Williams just dropped out. You know. We are known as the retarded Laverne and Shirley. Yeah, we all know. Right. That's oh, why Colin wow. did that Laverne and Shirley <laughs> reference. What a quinky dink! Wow. <laughs> she would call you, but she's working. Well, she comes up with the most <laughs> I don't give a shit statements, and she which makes it beyond fascinating. Oh, yes, because she interrupts real conversations. Right. Yes, yes, with her just oh, inane God. ramblings. <laughs> what? What's the Christmas plan? Yeah. Um, uh, the Christmas plans. Um, we're just There's gonna have a couple again. of friends over here. My son's coming over. Yeah. I would assume he's coming over. Are you going to put on a, are you going to watch any specials or anything on TV? Oh, oh, great question. Uh, specials yeah. on television? Yeah. Oh, question. Uh, question. Let me see. Question, uh, yeah. Question on top of question. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, probably. Uh, what are some of your favorites? Yeah. Miracle on 34th Street. Yeah. I always loved that one ever since I was a kid. I like um, the modern one better with Dylan McDermott. Oh, I, I don't like that one. Oh, you like that one? No. Yeah. I don't like, no, no, no. I, I, I like the older one. Why don't you like the newer one? Because, I don't know, you know. Because uh, <laughs> it's horrendous. The newer one, no, the with newer Dylan one. McDermott. You take this classic, but Colin likes the one with Dylan McDermott. <laughs> oh, Elizabeth Shue. Yes, yeah, Elizabeth, Elizabeth Shue. Shue. What was that uh, Tom Hanks uh, animated uh, one? Uh, the Polar Express. Yeah, do you like the Polar Express? <laughs> or is that, you know, I never saw does that, that hit home a little too much? Oh, or hit wow. you know, hit something. I yeah. Know, I never saw that one. Oh. All right. What? What? I mean, do you watch Frosty? Santa Claus is coming oh, to yeah, town. Yeah. 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 I used to have those for my son years ago. Oh yeah. Oh wow. You actually yeah. did something for him. Yeah. No. 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 I mean. Boy, you were I, able I, to afford a three pack. Does Marion come over? <laughs> no. Good oh. question. Yeah. Right. She. I don't know. I don't really. I have to ask her if she has any uh, other plans, which she probably does. I think yeah. she does. Hmm. Our calendar is probably full of the holidays. <laughs> that dance card. It's, um, She's the great in corner of Elizabeth, New Jersey. She's got like 12 holiday parties. <laughs> <laughs> no, it, it, it's really kind of early to tell. Kind of early to tell. I'll talk to her later. Yeah, it's real early to tell. Sure, she sure. can't wait. I'm going to talk to her. Can't wait to look down and see that caller ID coming across the old <laughs> <Right>. fucking <laughs> iPhone. Oh, man. <laughs> you, it starts with do not answer. Oh, uh, we just got more info. She yeah. just called a little while ago. Oh, good. Wow. That's that's good. You really added a that lot there. That is good. With her family, too. Huh? I think she has plans with her family. And uh, Lady Di, what about the big New Year's Eve oh, party? Shit. What uh, what are you going to be doing? Um, that I don't know about. What? You got to plan early, or you're going to be shut out. Miley Cyrus is going to be. Uh... <laughs> Doing the ball drop, you know. Oh, is she? Like a wrecking yeah. ball thing? Well, I guess. I'm sure she'll make some kind of reference to that. I'm sure she will. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure she will. Or if she doesn't, Seacrest will, you know that? Of course oh, he yeah, will. Well, he's clever, that Seacrest. He's the best. He's right. flinch from that kind of stuff. He'll be like, oh, he's don't the... touch the, you know, and climb this one or whatever. You know? Yeah, he's the best at all that, isn't he? Oh, my God. Uh, so, Lady Di, no New Year's Eve plans. What did you do last year for New Year's Eve? That's a good way to uh, gauge what you can. Actually, I slipped right through it. What? Of course you slept right through it. You slept, it. no, it's called passed out. Yeah, you passed out through it. You passed out through it. Oh, my God. 
through it. No, no, no. I mean, you know, I mean, New Year's is not a big deal to me. Now, if uh, somebody wants to take me out. Whoa, now you're talking. Colin, I heard yeah. that loud and clear. <laughs> <laughs> loud and clear. <laughs> I know a few people here that want to take her out. <laughs> Are you suggesting oh, Colin oh. ask you out for New Year's? Yeah. It would be nice, yeah. right? Oh, you know, she's yeah. uh, she's not quite playing hard to get over she's here. A big, she's no, a big no, guy. I like it. <laughs> I, like I like it. it. Yes, <laughs> yes. I don't go for that coy stuff. I like it. No, the straightforward oh. approach. Right. Uh, Diana. Lady Diana. You know, like Dirty Diana. Like yes, Dirty Di Lady Diana. Yeah. <laughs> Lady Di, would you, you know, do a little, would what? you do a little something what? with Colin Quinn if he takes you out New Year's? Yeah. Yeah. Why not? <laughs> It depends on college. Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> wow. Wow. A little reciprocation for some big plans. I'm sure Carl has uh, something big going on on New Year's Eve. Oh, yeah. Yeah? I, I don't know. Well, He's going to have to uh, um, instant direct message me or something or whatever. That's the way. She doesn't have to play this game. <laughs> it's, it's, like a, it's like a dance, isn't it, Carl? <laughs> this uh, whole man woman thing uh, it really is a, a oh. delicate oh. dance of love yes, it is. <laughs> <laughs> she knows how to play I'll even, i will even stay sober until uh 11 30. <laughs> well you know that's, wow. that's a big deal you got a pregame. That's how you know she doesn't have a problem. Right. Yeah, you got a pregame a little, Lady Di. Yeah. That'll loosen up a little bit. Just a little bit. That's Maybe a couple of shots. Yeah. Some Jaeger. No, I don't. I don't. Some Natty King Cole. And <laughs> Natty King Cole, yeah. Natty King Cole? Oh, that's what right. she, now she just repeats herself again. Well, Lady Di, it sounds terrific. Have you, you gotten all your shopping done, Lady Di? Oh, Christmas shopping. Actually, everybody, um, you see, I can't give that away. What? Everybody's getting Christmas cards with a little bit of uh, money in it. A little scratch. Oh, uh, lazy fuck. A little money in it. A little scratch. Better than going to need more than Elizabeth, probably. Yeah. How, how, mu how much money are you putting in the cards? Yeah. None of that. No, I'm not going to say that. How much? How about, much? Give us, give, us ball, give us ballpark. <clears throat> A thousand dollars. No, you're not. No. You're a lying sack of shit. No. no, no, no. No, how much uh, about? Oh, let me see. Yeah. Uh, should, I, should I say something or not? No, I can't tell you. Because yeah, yeah, yeah. Come yeah, on, say just uh, <laughs> die. Just <laughs> say it. What? Just let's get it over with. You're going to say it eventually, so just right. save us time. Right. <laughs> how much? Everybody's getting 25 hours. 25 bucks. 25 bucks. 25 smackaroos. Oh, nice. That's pretty good. From the Lady Die fortune. <laughs> From her dad's money. Fortune. Well, well, that's always give it up. Yeah, <laughs> she does. <laughs> She'll always give it up. <laughs> I think you. I think you fell under questioning. No big deal, huh? It's no big deal. It's no big deal. Twenty-five bucks. How many people? It certainly is. How many people are on your list? Well, actually, I only got four people on my list. That's a cool oh, hundy. Yeah. <laughs> a cool hundy. <laughs> Drop a banjo. <laughs> I, I just throw my money just like that. I, I'm not. You know, I don't have that much. Hey, around. you're not made of money. Right. You also yeah. don't have had a job in and, a long and, yeah, time. Yeah, and you so. haven't worked. Hey, yeah, Lady Di, have you have you tried to get a job lately? Yes, I have. Where'd you go? Ooh, I have. Breaking news. I went, I went all over the town of Elizabeth. And you know what? Let me tell you something right now. I might go beyond the town of Elizabeth. Wow. <laughs> she, wow. She's threatening other New Jersey towns. Branching out. <laughs> right. How'd the Burger King gig wow. go? How'd the Burger King gig go? idea i would really love for them to call me they're <laughs> <laughs> you 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 Just applied at burger king, king. Uh, yeah i did yeah how long ago was that um, I would say right now about maybe about a month ago oh, and you boy. just had fingers crossed for yeah. the old callback huh yeah that's that's that that's that go go to it attitude. Lady Die, our organization could really use a go getter <laughs> like you well you know what you know what we only have the one truck okay uh -huh. And um, Bill does need the truck every once in a while. We only have one vehicle. Yeah. All right. So I don't want to go too far. Isn't there public transportation? Right. right. That would explain why you haven't worked in six years. Public but, transportation? But from where I live to Burger King, 
That's only two blocks. That's two blocks down. You don't need no public transportation. All right. Well, well you can you, walk but the two you blocks. But you don't have that job. Right. <laughs> you got to get a job. You have to take the bus to Roosevelt I know what I got to get. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Lady Di, where else did you apply? Um... Well, I tried Family Dollar. That's <laughs> fucking Family Dollar. Enough again. with Family Dollar. How they don't many want times you. Are you gonna... I'm having a problem applying online with that. Of course, <laughs> like you did for the past year. Year. You've been talking about nice. that goddamn Family Dollar for <laughs> years. Uh, I tried it the Dunkin' Donuts. Oh, and the Dunkin' Donuts. <laughs> All right. They don't uh, want you. What do you mean they don't want me? They haven't called. Holy shit. They don't, Lady Die. They don't want you. Lady Die, you gotta read this play. And the ice man coming up, Eugene O'Neill. It's about a guy that sits there, he drinks in the bar, and he always says, I'm going out for a walk, and he never goes out for a walk. <laughs> <laughs> I'll okay. give you a big pickup call. <laughs> I love it. No, really, I, I, I did try a few other places. No, what other places? Yeah, what other places? Tell, Tell us. Pathmark. Um, there was, there's an application in there. They haven't called me. This was like two weeks ago I applied for this one. All right. Well, it's okay. Still early. And uh, um, let me see. Not exactly shop. No, I can't. No, not shop right. Um, oh well. Well, you got well, something you against them. Like Pathmark, yes, but not those <laughs> bastards over at Shoprite. Right? <laughs> no. <laughs> I don't know. Whole Foods. Yeah. yeah. Um, and I tried local supermarkets around here. Ah, uh, supermarkets. All right. Yeah. yeah. Trying to be a cashier, I see. Going for the cashier yeah. job. Okay. Oh, God. Imagine getting in her line. What a pain in the ass that would be. Oh, it's lettuce. My roommate bought some lettuce the other day. He's going to make a salad. That's fantastic. There's 100 people online waiting oh, to pay. Oh, God. Just is this babbling idiot Slow wants to talk motion. about the fucking avocado. Uh, don't they're really good this time of year. You know, my God, my roommate made a guacamole last night. It was wonderful. We all got together. I like to use it as a dip with certain things. And you just, like, fucking ring me up. Yeah. Colin, you, you missed uh, Lady Di's thoughts on Nelson Mandela. I, she surprised us all. Oh, uh, yeah. She, she gave him a great <laughs> tribute earlier. Oh, nice. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. yeah. Not, it was really a tragedy. Let's face it, Lady Di. 95 years old, right? Uh, Di? Uh, say that one more time again. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm saying it's a tragedy. Uh, what? It was a tragedy. Right? Was, he was a drunkie? <laughs> no, that's you. <laughs> and I have a nutty ice. <laughs> yeah. You are, are you I, deaf? I, I, no I, one was born with the nutty ice. Nutty ice. <laughs> yes. Nah, nobody was born with a beer can in there. It was a nice tribute. Oh, my God. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. It was terrific. She yeah. she had a lot to say. But she, she says he's a great man and was a great president, but she can't name one thing that he's ever done. And she said she doesn't know why he was in prison for all that time because she was very young then. Right. I was very young back then. Yes, I was. So. Right. so I have, I have no you. idea why he was in prison. I know. Well, I didn't really, hear his name until about 1987 myself. So <laughs> yes. <so. laughs> 1987. You know what? When, when this movie, when the Mandela movie comes out on, um, yeah. uh, uh, what do you call it? Uh, you know, uh, when it comes Mandela out on, movie? Uh, yeah, when yeah. it comes out on Netflix or whatever that is, then I'll... Oh, it's Netflix. I'll with, with, yeah, whatever. And then you'll learn yeah. about it from a movie. Mm. Yeah, sure. Yeah. <laughs> All right, well, uh, that's how a lot of us get our knowledge. But in, so. the, but in the meantime... I, 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 I was young. But in the meantime, you're going to just go online and everywhere and talk about what a great man he was, not knowing anything about him. Right. He could have been a horrible person. You don't know. I, I have no idea about him, but I, <laughs> I've never heard anything. Well, let's put it this way. Out of all the times I watched the news, I never heard anything bad about him. <laughs> <laughs> this is America right uh, here. I know. Lady she, Di is America. She is every voter. Wow. <laughs> never heard of Ben Worth. That, <laughs> okay. That's fantastic, right. Lady Di. Hey, I never heard anything bad about him. So it's got to be. Sounds like a nice enough guy. Yeah. I, I don't know. I mean, I just never really heard anything bad about him. Plus, he uh, he was 95 years old. And oh, he's got to be okay sure. then. Sure. So right. was like Joseph Mengele. Mm -hmm. I think he was an old guy, too. We really got a break. Oh, damn it.
Oh my! Well, guys, yeah, that was fantastic. Kyle, including me in a lovely afternoon. I love when it. You die, I'll see you or not see you on New Year's Eve. Maybe it'll be one of those like, uh, what was that? Oh, Sleepless in Seattle. Did they mean like New Year's? Yeah, New Year's Eve on the on top of the Empire State Building. God, you got to go. That she could crawl up the outside. You got to go over her house for Christmas dinner, man. Oh my <laughs> God. Oh, that'd be great. Oh my God. You want to invite Colin? Yeah, he knows she, he's invited. He did invite you. He's got to figure it out. There's an envelope there for me too. With it. <laughs> no taking that back. As long as there is an envelope for her. Yeah. Who the hell is this? Uh, that's what that's this? the that's the broad from the talk, right? Who? What? He's calling anyway. I think that's the broad from the talk. Who's this little blonde over there. Know, the a lot of uh, a lot of uh, a lot of juice walking by our studio right now. Yeah. How do you know their religion? Yeah. Oh, geez. Happy holidays to all of you in the studio. Uh, thank you, Lady Di. All right. Uh, the wow. same to you, and of course, uh, Marion. Yes, yes. The other half. I'll let her know. Do you still talk to Marion? <laughs> yeah, I still talk to Marion. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. I can't. Colin just left. Yeah, he's he's had enough. I don't blame him. He had enough. He doesn't want to OD on this. I hope. Uh, I want. I was trying to get a Colin Quinn plug in. I don't know where he's going to be this weekend. Oh. Mike Bichetti. Sorry about that. Uh, that's okay. I, what was I, I going to say? Died. Do you know? I do, when I first heard of Mandela, I thought Noriega died. I got them confused. Oh well, Noriega's been dead for a while, isn't yeah. he? Is really? He? I, don't, I didn't know. <laughs> I have no idea. I think he was. I thought he was. I don't, I don't know. I'm not good at current events, really. Yeah. 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 Well, you and Lady Di. You, you well, two are a uh, match made in heaven. <laughs> it's too bad Lady Di looks like shit, or this would be a really good thing uh, for you, Mike Bichetti. You don't mind, Mike. You don't want to be like that girl that went, uh, <laughs> that fucking <laughs> said that about you when you were growing up. Right. No, no, you don't not, want to see I'm Lady Di and go, oh, fuck, that sucks. You know, then you'd just be doing what, she, what that, that fucking bitch did. Oh, no. No, you're right, because you just come back to hit me in the butt. Yeah, so, you know, maybe you Wait, two. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. What? what? How do you spell his last name? Mike Bichetti? <laughs> what is that? What are you, why? What are you doing? Taking notes? No, no, no. What I'm going to do, I'm, uh, I'm going to uh, pull up a picture of him, because I don't even, I, I never saw oh, him. Oh, okay. This, this could be fun. Oh, okay. All right. You, nice. Are you by your computer right now, Lady Di? Uh, the, my phone is my computer. Hey. All right. It's, are you, oh. you ready to type? No, 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 no. What's how do you spell his last name? B O C C H E T T I. Mike B O C C H. Yes. Okay. E. The Shetty. T T I. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. B O C C H. D? D? D. D. <laughs> Bachetti. How does Bar. how does D work into Bachetti? I. I, 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 what do you got so far? Yeah. D O C C H. E T T I. E T T I. Okay. And when I have a chance, I'll pull up a picture. Of what the fuck? No, we want to do it. Whoa, I'm, I'm, I'm putting put on the back door now. Back oh. door now. What? You can't use your phone and uh, look things up at the same time. I can, but I don't want to do that. Why? <laughs> what, what are you religious? I don't want to gasp when she sees my picture, maybe that's what. It is. Put it on speaker. Why don't you want to do that now? Put it on speaker and look it up. That. Huh? I don't want to do that. Why? I mean, she didn't know what Colin Quinn looks like. This has to do with Colin, anything. Colin gave up the on us a while ago. Hell. I don't blame him. She didn't write down the name. She doesn't know his name. Spelled. No, I know. Yes, I, did. I wrote it down. All right. How do, how do you spell it? B O C C H E T T I. Oh. Right. right again. All right. She's All good. Right. That didn't take I, long. I know. I, I'm going to look it up later on. Oh, God. With this oh, one. thanks. I, I, I like being tossed in the furnace. <laughs> yeah, yeah. She's going to judge you. So what are you, judging him? Oh, no. Women are like, oh, yeah. They're very, like, anybody. No, women are very pl planistic. Yeah. Planistic indeed. Where, where are you thinking? You two go out to some gin mill or something? Oh, I haven't drank in years. Yeah, he, he doesn't drink, Di. Uh, what do you think? Yeah. That's okay. Why? That's How is that okay? Right. You're a lush. Oh no! It just means more for her. <laughs> oh, that's true. No, right. it doesn't mean more for me. Oh, no. oh, but, 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 sorry, I, I really meant oh, that. Oh, that's when I not said it. more. But no. Mike, Mike, you got to deal with a girl that like wants to drink all the time. That's kind oh, of no. that's kind are of you, a pain. Are you a good drunk? Oh, she's not a good not person. A good at anything? Yeah. Are you a good drunk, Lady Die? No, no, no. I usually eat. What are you no. talking about? If I, if the if I just, if I just, if I just slept, I would be drunk. What the fuck? 
No, I'm sure. Yeah, no shit. I said, are you a good drunk? Am I a good drunk? Yeah. What the fuck? Oh. Question with a question. No, no, no one was no one was ever questioning the fact that you eat, Lady Di. Right. <laughs> all right. No, no, no. I, uh, I'm uh, I'm all right. Yeah. You, you, I'm good. When I, I worry when people say they're right when they drunk. I bet she gets belligerent. Like, sure. No, I know. I know I don't get belligerent. Do you get? <laughs> uh, how do you get? Do you get fun? Happy. 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 I'll go no yeah. punch and fight at Walmart. <laughs> mm. <laughs> All right, we should we should go. All right, we'll take a break then. Yeah, we gotta take a break, everyone. Okay. Okay. Happy holidays. Thanks. Yes, happy holidays. Thank you, Bichetti. We're gonna probably try to get you in here uh, next week because we're really gonna fool around next week. Oh, oh yeah. Thanks. It's the last uh, week of radio for the year, and we're gonna just fucking goof off. Last big All fiesta right. of the year. All right. Yeah, it'll be fun, man. I love you guys. Thank you so much. Yeah, Lady Di, you want to come in? Uh, do I want to come in next? Uh, oh my God, the question. Um, uh, let's see what happens. I don't know. Yeah, uh, let's play let's it just, by ear. <laughs> right. No, no, let's no. just you know see what happens. Why? What do you have planned, Lady? I Di? wish I could just live my whole oh, life playing it by ear like play her. By ear. Yeah, the monkeys <laughs> might be on TV. Right. You never know. <laughs> The monkeys are on TV only one hour on a uh, It was a oh, joke, okay. you stupid right. fuck. Thank God she put the. <laughs> thank God she got the schedule out. Let me know when the monkeys are on. Uh, she answers jokes. She answers jokes. jokes. She answers puns. She answers sarcasm. She just. But she'll tell everyone she's a huge fan of the show. Oh, yeah. She's a huge fan of the show. I know. We don't know why, though. Lady Die. Why are I you? I always love you guys. Come on. Why are you a huge fan of the show? I loved you guys from the very beginning. Come on. Why? 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 The question is why? why. Because you guys are funny. Oh, I am. It doesn't seem like you really know what funny I, is. I, I, yeah. when you were, no, when when you were on, um, I, I have nothing against XM. I just don't have it. All right. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but when you were when you were on WDW. And I used to drive home in the morning, uh, in the morning, in the afternoon. Yeah. Okay. I used to listen to you guys all the time. Oh, well, you're weaving all over the road. <laughs> playing, <laughs> being hammered. Right. I'm weaving all over the road. Oh, all right. Okay. Yeah, answer the question. Right. Answer, answer the joke. Oh, whatever. Answer everything. Holy shit. Stop oh. answering everything. God. Stop right. answering everything. Right. <laughs> Lady, die. What? You used to You used to drive home from the beer place a little tipsy, right? No. A little, a little. There. You, you, a used little to, bit, right? but you used to have a couple of no. beers during no, the work day. No. All right, lady. Di, to be fair, when was the last time that you did drive a little? Inebriated? A little tipsy. Mm -hmm. The last time I drove the truck. Yeah, yeah, with a little, a couple beers okay. in you, just a couple of beers. I didn't have any beer on me, but I, but I drove it yesterday. A little drunk. No. But what time? What time did you drive the truck yesterday? I don't know, around 10 in the morning. Well, you drink every morning <laughs> before 9. Whoa. So you had a couple no, of beers. I, I did, no, I did not. You, yes, had, you, you did. You had a couple of beers I, yesterday I morning. I don't drink and drive. No, I don't do things like that. But, no. you, but you had a couple of beers yesterday morning. No. Or did you? <laughs> no. <laughs> I tried to call the show up yesterday. What happened to your phone? And then if we would have answered and asked you what you were drinking, you would have said Natty Ice. Yeah. I See? Sure. See? But you said you didn't drink <laughs> yesterday. But, 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 well, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. I, I knew I was going to drive, so I was not drinking. All right? After I stopped calling, I just uh, waited until around 10 o'clock, and then I went out. And had but, a, but you had some before? drinks before that. Not. I did not. No, I didn't. The lying. True. All right. Guys, how much does it take to get a head tank? Mm. Yeah, how many beers before you're drunk, uh, Lady Di? Yeah. Me? Yeah. Uh, you. No, the no, other person no. we're talking the to other with lady the name Lady Di yeah. that uh, drinks. The same. Um, I don't know. Maybe about 12. <laughs> 12, <laughs> 12 beers in you. Yeah. <laughs> just a guess. 12, 12 beers. 12 beers. <laughs> you know, 10 beers just takes the edge off. Oh my God. <laughs> 12, 12, 12, 12 beers to get drunk. Hey, she says you You're want to know the truth. Rhinoceros. Oh my God. Holy shit. She needs two seconds. You can hit her with a tranquilizer and it doesn't do, fucking have an effect on her. <laughs> Lady it die. Takes, uh, it takes a lot for me to get drunk. Oh. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's called tolerance yep it happens with alcoholics yep speaking of tolerance we have none for you right. none none <laughs> oh, 
All right, uh, we got to go. We got yes. Dan Soder. Like you said, have a great week. Yeah, Mike, we'll Thanks. we'll try to book you for next week if you're around. All right. Yeah. Definitely around, guys. Thank you. Great. All right, and thank you for everything wait, today. Wait, 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 hold what? on. You what? guys are going to be around next week? Didn't we ask her in? Yeah, yeah. we did it a couple times. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. I'm going to keep that in mind. Okay. <laughs> for what? I'm just, I'm just saying I'm going to keep that in mind. For what? For what? For what? Next week. What? I thought you guys were going on vacation. You don't even have satellite radio. I but, know I don't have satellite radio. What are you what keeping it in mind it Yeah, what are you keeping in mind for? Great question. Marion has the satellite radio. I don't have Why, it. Why are you keeping it in mind? This has to stop. Because <laughs> Marion uh, will keep me updated about what you know what's going on with you guys. Holy oh, my shit. God. It's a dumb radio <laughs> show. Go <laughs> fucking <laughs> breathe somewhere. It's a dumb Not person. Only- what? No, not not only that, but I also keep in touch with you, you know, on the computer also. <laughs> oh, that's oh. good. <laughs> she doesn't answer. She had no answer for why she was going to keep that in mind. Why are you keeping it in mind? We I invited you in. I know you invited me in. You're coming in. You got nothing going on. So if you knew we were inviting in, then why would you say, are you guys on next oh, week? Guys, guys, guys. Uh, I, I, I usually like coming in with Marion. Come on. And you know she works. Just shut up. Okay. So I'll tell you the truth. Marion is I, I holding you back like, anyway, no, so yeah. just come in here without her. She's not holding me back? She's not holding me back. I like to come in with her. You can come you in here and I, discharge on your own. Right. Yeah. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Hold on a second. That was <laughs> that that was that was nothing. That discharge was nothing. Clear <laughs> 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 discharge. <laughs> A clear it, discharge. She had, for the people that don't know, yeah, she had a clear discharge uh, you, you, last time she was in. You came. She, she came in her pants last time she was in studio. Right. Oh, God. Yeah, I, I came in <laughs> and I had to go to the bathroom and, yeah. There was a little bit of cum in the panties. Yeah, Mike, you might have to deal with some so clear tough. discharge. Oh, you, no. <laughs> 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 oh, you guys were going on break. <laughs> she squirted while Kenny was talking to her. Yeah, we don't know what it was. Yeah. What would Colin do? Get off the phone? Yeah, he bailed yes. on this a long time ago. I don't blame him. We probably Aww. should have, too. All right, Lady Di, thank you. Happy holidays. And you, too. And maybe I'll call you next week, okay? Uh, uh, maybe. Maybe. All right. Yeah. All right, guys. Happy, happy holidays. All right, Mike Buschetti. What's your uh, Twitter, Mike? Oh, it's uh, Mike Buschetti at, at Twitter. <laughs> All right, uh-huh. so it's Mike B-O-C-C-H-E-T-T-I. Oh, uh, yeah. Thank okay, you, Mike Buschetti. All right. Okay. All right. Okay, cool. All, All right, guys. All right. Have a great day. All right. Hey. All right. Take care. Also, the Hi, key. Hi. Oh. Well, what? oh, boy. Go ahead. What, what were you going to say? What? It wasn't what for you. you. It wasn't for fucking you. We said bye already. Yeah. All right. All right. I'll talk to you later. I'll talk to you next week, okay? Have a nice weekend. Bye. Holy shit. She I, is. I, don't, I, I gotta be honest. I don't even know if that's good radio. Oh, I, I have it. no idea. I love it. I could talk to her for four straight hours. Yeah. She is so annoying. It, it's so <laughs> fucking annoying to but, listen but, to her. But it's Throw not, every question back at us. Yeah, it's not annoying if you if you understand all her tells, where she answers every question with a question before yeah. she answers the question, and then she answers jokes, puns, and anything humorous. <laughs> yeah, as if it's serious. As if as it as was it, a serious, serious question presented right. to her. Right, right. Also, she lies constantly. Yeah. Yes. Oh, Lady Di, it's like you're from the moon or something. I'm not from the moon. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm not from the moon. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, cool. All right, we because we, we were speculating whether you were from the moon. Our assumption was that you lived on the right. moon. Mm. Right, write this down. We got our next bit with her. Uh, next time, it's all questions just like, like that. Outrageous fucking Out, the, things. The more outrageous, the better. Just to hear her go, no, I'm not from uh, the moon. That's like when uh, Lady Di was a fucking phantom pilot in Vietnam. Right. I was never a phantom <laughs> pilot in right, Vietnam. Right, right. No, no. No, no. I wasn't a phantom pilot in that's Vietnam. The let's let's oh, roll with that next okay. time. You'll remember? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Okay. That will be the bit. Yeah, because she's fucking insane. Yes. <laughs> Got the mad Cuban in studio. We booked him instead of Guy Fieri. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, that's what the fuck this Yeah. Is. Oh, you had no idea? What the fuck am I doing here? We bailed on Guy, but we, we saw that you were with him, so we booked you. A last minute uh, booking. He's been in here for 40 minutes. I'm going yeah. to get fired. The whole oh, time. Oh, shit.
Guys, people have been calling him. <laughs> right. Going like, where the fuck are you? He just keeps turning his phone off. <laughs> oh, then, man. And then we got Dan Soder, who's been patiently waiting outside. Yeah. So we, uh, we're we going to take a break, and then we're going to continue to stay the there. The Cuban's sticking around. Yes, he is. Oh, the Opie and Anthony Show. The Opie and Anthony Show. Serious XM. All right. Well, that sucked. To hear the Opie and Anthony show five days a week, live on satellite radio, online on your phone or tablet, or even on demand, go to SiriusXM.com. Also, interact with the Opie and Anthony show on Twitter, at Opie Radio, at Anthony Cumia, and at Jim Norton. <laughs>